What is going on guys? So today I got a super quick video for you and it is how to filter your Steam games in your Steam library. Um, it's very quick so if you just open up Steam and then you go to the library tab up here, uh, I click on store just to be brought to the main screen. So we click home on the library tab. If you just click the tab it brings you automatically to home anyways. But on the left hand side here you'll see all your games. There is this advanced filtering option here, which is what you're going to want to pick. And then you can filter the games this way. So we can do single player only games. Actually, that's not true. Games that have single player uh, components to them, because Battlefield 1 is definitely not a single player only game. Um, but yeah, then there's multiplayer games that have some multiplayer to them. So Among Us, obviously not a single player game at all. Uh, games that have some co-op, arguably would say Among Us does not, but sure ready to play um, that is what's installed on your computer and ready to play installed locally same kind of thing which is why nothing really changes when you select them um, and then there's games that you've played and there's a bunch of other things so like controller preferred all uh, controller support so this is a way to view games that actually uh, support a controller that you can play with a controller so i'll make another video for that but very cool. Um, and then, yeah, it can show you which controllers it supports as well. So Xbox controller, uh, these games support an Xbox controller. DualShock controller is the PlayStation one, and none of them support that, which is interesting because I just happened to buy an Xbox one by chance. DualSense, okay, Steam Input API. Then there's VR games, HDR, what is that? Not even sure. Um, and yeah, then there's Steam Deck games. So if you want to pick games that are playable on the Steam Deck, you can do that. And yeah, um, there's also feature trading cards. Let's actually get rid of this. Okay, so these are games that feature trading cards. Not all games do, clearly. Games that have workshop, maps. And yeah, I'm going to stop going on and rambling. I think two minutes is long enough, but... There's a bunch of things you can do with this filtering, and yeah, that's, it'll just filter the left-hand side here, so just keep that in mind. But yeah, hopefully you found this helpful, guys. If you did, drop a like. Don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching.